Yo, what's up? The name is Gently. I want to welcome back to more Legend of Zelda Ocarina of Time as we continue on with the Shadow Dungeon. As last episode, we came across a mysterious tunnel. And look, there's a fan at the end of us, and I don't... Or a fan at the end of us. No, English failure. There's a fan at the end of the hallway. And I don't mean fan in a good way. Alright. And now... While you can just wait for the fan to shut off, it's easier just to wait yourself down so much no wind will ever be able to knock you out of the way. Logic. This one's a problem, though. There should be a lock-on thingy somewhere. I guess not. So you just have to make yourself wait. So once this shuts off, we're gonna need to switch to our hover boots so we can fly. We gotta fly. Alright. The fan is off. Hover link, hover. Hover link. There. Made it. Now this one's a pretty tricky puzzle. I like this one. This is one of my favorite rooms in the entire game. No. Let's see. So, if you didn't see that right there, that door just, or that door, that eye just opened only to shoot at us. So you've got to be quick on the draw. And I get pushed into a pit. Nice going! Oh, don't tell me. Oh, I... Game is serious right now. No. Stop it. I'm going to wind up needing a fairy by the end of this really badly, aren't I? So just wait for it. Ow. Stop that. No. Roll forward. Gotta outlast the fan! Outlast the fan! Unorthodox gameplay methodology. I have to just outlast the fan. I don't even need to do this right. I just did it right, and now I'm just going to be like, I don't care. Logic. Screw logic. Logic never got me anything. Okay, now fall. Now this, I'm going to keep the iron boots on so I don't fall. Can roll. Alright. Curses. Okay. So I saw it shoot the fire. but I failed to react fast enough. Although I don't know if you even need to shoot it in the eye, but let's just note this. That's fake over there. I give up. So what you're want, gonna want to do to make use of that fake wall over there is this. Yippee. And it blows you all the way over to where you need to go. Open the door. It's locked! Oh, great. Gibdos. Gibdos, gibdos everywhere. Come on, I inputted a jump attack. No, get off me! I don't have the health to spare. Get off, that's cheating! My sword is on the way to your face. And that pot just completely transcended. Okay. Is, uh, what? I don't even know what just happened. I like put him for a jump attack. He stopped, I hit the attack button, he did the jump attack. And I have low HP. There's a random chest right here. And it's got a blue rupee, but there's a locked door. So, geez, I wonder what that could mean. Oh, wait, the door just unlocked. But, I think... Is this that room that was clever? Yeah, there's a crack in this ground over here. So, you know what that means. Wherever there's a crack in anything, bombs. Okay. Bang. Now, it still looks like there's nothing there, and I'm going to be very unhappy if there actually is nothing there, but nope, there's a chest. They doubly tricked you. First, they put a rock over it, and it's invisible. They hardcore. They hardcore trap makers. And it's a Deku nut. I needed a heart piece. Heart piece. I need just a life heart, please. And, oh wow. I did not mean to go the right way. So this, this is the boat of the dead that we saw a few episodes ago only three episodes ago actually we shouldn't already be at the end yet but anyways let's just set this up so I can go run off and do nonsense 
in the meantime. So get the block onto the path and then push the block. Heave ho, heave ho, heave ho. Okay, we're not on a boat. Even though that song is fun to play on a saxophone. Okay, enough of that. But yes, we are not going to go on the boat. And we are not on a boat, so we do not need to do the rower cheers that they did or whatever. So, let's climb. And I'm just going to show off the boat, and I'm not going to go on the boat. Because look, boat. There's a Triforce on it. And it does stuff. I believe. Yeah. So let's try the song of time. Because Navi was just randomly going over there. So maybe there's like blocks in midair or something. No? No. Never that easy, is it? And I forgot to switch my bow back up for my long shot. Long shot, but I don't mean the one from Gears. I have no idea how to get over there, but I do know this. Let's see. We go up this, and it will lead us back to... Yeah. This is where we were at pretty much near the beginning in the room with the first Reaper statue. It, it said, go see the boat. We, we came, we saw the boat, we actually reached the boat. But now it's time to ignore the message. And go search for some way to end... The beeping noise because I only have two hearts out of 14. I'm missing 14. Okay. I don't know if I can just walk back over the thing. Okay, yes, I can. No! And that was bad timing. No. Take the boots off. And then pull myself up. Pull yourself up. What? I just died. It's gonna respawn me and then I die. Yeah. Don't. Good thing I have a fairy. I got. I was trying to hang from a ledge. I got lit on fire. Ain't that just lovely? So, let's just turn on the lens of truth. Ow. And wait until the fan stops. And then we can go over there because that door was open. I'm pretty sure it leads to something. I just don't know what it leads to. Because my memory isn't that great. I have terrible, terrible, terrible memory. Okay. I don't know why you would need to shoot the eye either. I bet you you probably can't. And I was just thinking that you needed to. But there's a door. It's locked. And Navi says, hey! Here, I can hear the spirits whispering in this room. Those who have sacred feet should let the wind guide them. Then they will be led to the hidden path. That's what they are saying. Oh, what? I already went over there. We already went to the boat of the dead. So I have to go kill both the re-deads to escape. And get to go back with the knowledge I already had. Okay, so this room is completely and utterly superfluous, I believe. Yep, invisible treasure chest. But it's not an important invisible treasure chest. It's just arrows. Just in case you want to try to shoot that eye. That or I think they just figured out that people kept trying to shoot the eye. And you can't shoot the eye. And that fire just stopped right behind me. I will not be lit aflame. I made it. I made it. This room's already clear. So it's time to go hop on the boat of the dead. Yep, yep. Ow. And take some damage. And get have a pot thrown at us. By magic! Magic through the pot, man. Okay. Enough of this. It's time to get serious. Ahem. Come on, chums, let's do this. Leroy. Okay. So, Triforce symbol. What do you do every single time there's a freaking Triforce symbol? Hold up. I'm at least getting the gold sculpture. Bang. Sniper. Sniping with this thing, man. Long shots, nuts. It's crazy. Can't go get those hearts though, but what do you do every time you see a Triforce symbol? Da -da -da -da. However, we're not doing that this episode. So, this has been Gently One, and next time we shall be riding on the boat of death. See you next time.